This is the shooting show news. Scottish estates have opposed plans to force them to allow huge deer culls on their land. An environment group has told Scotland's Rural Affairs Committee that landowners should be fined if they fail to meet strict cull targets, with the state then carrying out the rest of the cull itself. But landowners have spoken out against the plans, backing the current system of independent deer management, which is worth £105 million to the economy. Two months into the Royal Berkshire Shooting School's Strathstone Super 7 Challenge, George Digweed leads the standings. The 25-bird simulated present drive offers competitors the chance to win a supercar worth over £100,000. There have been over 80 entries so far, but Digweed is the only one to shoot 25 straight, guaranteeing him a place in the final. We've had Mr Digweed, who uh, has uh, had uh, two goes at the uh, challenge, and uh, his fourth attempt on the tower, he shot 25 which was, uh, in my lifetime, I don't think I'll ever see that again. Uh, it was uh, an unbelievable feat. Even George himself said, I don't think he'll ever do that again. And the good thing for him, he'll be guaranteed to uh, come back in the final um, and take part to try and win the car. The most important thing to get across, I would say, is um, if anyone's slightly confused, is he hasn't um, won the car yet. For everyone else, entries stay open until the end of January, so there's still everything to shoot for. The Temple Shoot at Rockley won the Gold Award at the Purdy Awards last week. Over 30 years, the shoot has transformed a 2,000-acre arable farm into the wildlife habitat, with 23 miles of hedgerows, a million trees and nine dew ponds. The Silver Award went to Vinehouse Farm, the second time it has won the award, and the bronze to Lees Court Shoot near Faversham. Firearms crime is at a 10-year low north of the border. The latest government statistics show alleged crime involving firearms, including air guns, has now dropped for six years on the trot and is 75% lower than its 10-year high in 2007. Basque Scotland's Nicole Hamilton said the statistics further demonstrate that air gun licensing is not necessary. And finally, Scotland is one of the top three countries in the world to visit, according to renowned travel guide publisher Lonely Planet. A host of hunting, shooting and fishing activities has propelled Scotland into the world's elite. On top of this, Scotland is hosting the Commonwealth Games and the Ryder Cup in 2014. The Country Sports Tourism Group said the accolade proves what a great place Scotland is and how much it has to offer visitors. That was the Shooting Show News.